Shelley, I know I'm always banging on about how you can't put soap on your vulva, but today we're going to talk about why. Oh, look, Ginny, you know me. If I could get a toilet brush and, like, cover it with soap and insert it, scrub around and whip it out, I would feel school wiki clean. And you'd feel my hand giving you a big slap on your face. Because not only are you not allowed to ever stick anything inside the vagina, but the soap is really bad as well. You're just going to destroy all that beautiful chemistry inside your vulva and vagina and get rid of all that protective acid. Uh, acid? My vagina is acidic? totally acidic. In fact, if you remember back to high school science, with pH, the measure of acid, with zero being kind of battery acid, 14 being like bleach, seven being neutral, a lot of soaps are around about 11. Your vulva sits at around 3.8 to 4.5, a lot like an orange, <gasps> which is why we don't ever want to use soap. Instead, we want to use products that are specifically formulated to have a natural pH range. And so we're going to do an experiment. Absolutely. We're going to combine science and vaginas, our favourite topics. Okay. pH strip. Which tell us exactly the pH of the product Shelley's going to test, including this disgusting fruity scented soap. Ooh, that's going really green. That's Green's like... nasty. 8-9. Eight, 8-9 nine. Eight, nine is alkaline. That's going to destroy the chemistry of your vagina very quickly. This vagina orange. I love a good euphemism, Shelley. <laughs> It's kind of orange. Then... That's acid. That's where we want it to be. Perfect. This wash. The nice formulated <gasps> one. Snap! They match! Exactly <laughs> why that sort of product is going to do far better things for your vulva than any nasty, disgusting scented soap. I don't care how fruity it is. I love this. Laughing and learning.